A group of some of the most accomplished athletes in the world came together tonight to celebrate two Utahns. This is pretty cool. Connor Mance and Clayton Young just qualified to run in the Paris Olympics. New specialist Aaron Cox joined us live with their impressive support system. And boy, is that impressive, Aaron. It is super impressive, Mike and Dini. They had about six Olympians there tonight celebrating Connor and Clayton and their big win in Florida, but they're already talking about their plans for Paris. From one Olympian, inspiring the next. The hard part is about being an Olympian regardless of what you do. Connor Mance and Clayton Young became the first two Americans to qualify for the 2024 Olympic Marathon in Paris. They placed at the Olympic Marathon Trials in Florida this past weekend. Going out to, to Paris, France to represent all of, all of the people who've helped me out, um, especially my wife, has been, it's been pretty special. Definitely this mentality of play to win instead of play not to lose. That's kind of the idea of offense versus defense. Connor from Smithfield has dreamed of this. Ever since I've known what the Olympics is, I thought that would be a really, really cool thing um, to be a part of. For Clayton, who went to high school in American Fork, he took his running step by step. I wanted to, you know, make the varsity team in high school. And then, you know, once I got to college, I wanted to get on the traveling team and I wanted to go to regionals and I wanted to go to nationals. And it's been baby steps the whole way. The two are part of the first official professional racing team in Utah. Clayton will do most of his training in Utah. Connor hopes to move to Europe and train closer to the Olympic course. It's super exciting. I think it's been a surreal dream. Like he's always had that self-belief that he could do the work to get to the next level. Olympic silver medalist Meb Kafleski flew in for the party to wish them well, saying the fact that two from Utah made it onto the Olympic team is pretty special. Very unique because you don't hear that every day or every, you just wants an opportunity and I hope they can help each other. It's a pretty awesome group there. Now, when they run in Paris, they have to take the humidity and the elevation to account. And so while they're training, they're going to use saunas and they'll layer up on their clothing to create a similar effect. And take into account, this is Clayton's first international trip he'll ever make. Live in Alpine, Aaron Cox for KSL 5 News.